this VIP list gets into the open, all hell's gonna break loose. The cartel's gonna lose connections all over the world. I would not want to be Garzito when El Sueño finds out. I heard that. He'd best find some place where Santa Blanca can't get to him. Like Mars or the bottom of the fucking Mariana's Trench. Garzito will be fine. People like him always find a way to survive. He'll probably drop out of sight and turn up in a year or two, running a resort on the fucking Riviera. Guy looks out for drunks and fools. And sleazy motherfuckers named Garzito. <laughs> We got more targets for you. Suckers don't know we moved. They're heading the wrong way. Shift position. Roger that. Stay there. Yo, copy that. Sniper's got us targeted. the HQ building.
to set up a perimeter while we wait for the download. Download complete. We're good to go. I'm not even sure I want to know who's on that guest list. The Bilderberg group, most likely. The who? Exactly. Goldman, Agua Verde is all clear. It'll take them years to repair these relationships. Carzita's business in Agua Verde is done. Some people on that VIP list are going to get very uncomfortable meetings. Government heavies are going to ask what the fuck they were doing in Bolivia. We're doing good. Keep hitting them hard. Ramon Feliz. Blogger. Academic. Internet journalist. All he ever wanted was to tell the truth. But whose truth? His? Feliz thought that there is only one truth. But we know that truth, like history is written by the winner. His blog slandered me day after day after day. Por supuesto, something had to be done. So I hired hackers to track him down and offered him a job. I explained that telling my truth was much more preferable. My truth kept him alive. All Ramon Feliz ever wanted was to tell the truth. Now he had more truth than he could bear. A captured rebel being held in the village of Colta might have valuable intel on Liuri and El Polito. Rescue him from the cartel and find out what he knows. Drive. And like nothing and nobody is gonna stop me from getting what I chingada Set. madre want. And I tell those huequillas, and I'm telling you, do the same damn thing. It's the only way a woman can win in our world. And if you live a life like ours, if you don't win, you're fucking dead. So even if being a bad morra doesn't feel true, if you act like it is, Enough people will believe it, that it will become the truth. You have paid your dues, suffered the same hardships, accomplished the same successes as your male co-workers. But because you are a woman, you will always be seen as la trapadora who fucked her way up the ranks of the cartel. This is Lydia Flores. And orgullosas, buchonas, leves, you know who you are. Many of the women working in Santa Blanca have asked me how I did it. How did I rise through the ranks to become the most feared and respected woman in the cartel? We'll let the rebels know where to find these supplies. They can pay us back later. Yo, cartel gunman, near the ruins. The drone is up. Spotting another tango, and baby makes three. That makes five.
Looks like Kulta is still smoldering. Keep an eye out for the rebel they've got held here. Say the word, boss. Target is down. Okay, we're still good. I got another. That's five. That was fucking close. Hostile down. Hey, we got a narco. In front of the church. Down. You're giving yourself away. I got a third target. Got another tango. I got a third. Sniper! Fucking hell! That's a kill. Clear on this side. Hey, hey, abre la puerta, compa. Open the door. You okay, hermano? What do you want from me? Yuri and Polito, the fuckers who tortured you. We're here to make them pay for what they did. But we need to know where they took you. We didn't travel far. I... I remember that much, and it was quiet, out in the country somewhere. There, there... there was a smell, like old animal skins. That's all I know. I... I'm sorry. It's all right. At least now we know they're close by. Gracias. <laughs> 